Hello again, and thank you for tuning into Craven YGO. Um, today we're gonna go over a uh, something near and dear to my heart, Chaos Max right here. Um, we're gonna go over a little bit of history first before we go into the way I have applied it to the current Dragon Link builds. Um, as some of you may know, if you're Chaos Max enthusiasts, you can put there's a combo before it got banned at least, um, Chaos Max and Boral Savage on the field at the same time. Um, combo is relatively simple, um, just takes one banned card. Uh, where did I put my, where are you? Oh. What you want to do is you want to get Halky on the board, at least how it was. As you can tell, you know, that's banned. Um, you can no longer use that. This is the key to getting both of those monsters out at the same time, or was the key. What you want to do is send Halky to the grave, cross, cross for your tokens, you know, one star, bam, you get your three star token and your Marshall Metal Marcher. Normally, you'll use like Ready Driver or um, Draco Ned or something like that. So you'll have a one star tuner here. Three star and one star. And that's you, the tuner, Herald of the Arclight. Three star and the one star tuner you would normally have. Could you the second. See where I'm going? So then the Heralds. And their effects, Heralds make Boral Savage. Boral Savage. Click with that, so 3750. And then they get their searches for Chaos Max. And either if you have it in your grave or you have it in your hand or in your deck, one or the other. So for our purposes, we'll use this. You have your Chaos Max on the field, Boral Savage. Everything all in one turn. Now, that's a little archaic as you can't use this guy. This kills the whole thing. And then at this point, if you can get one effect monster on the board, guess what you're going to hit your opponent with? One effect monster. One effect monster. So that's any of your wyver burster or collapse serpent or anything one effect monster and then you're dropping a dragon dragon with that so tuna gates chaos max and then it's if you i've been putting parallel exceeds in my builds um one parallel exceeds hit the board that's an extra deck lockout so just imagine a union carrier with that so you got dragoon hitting the board bam dragoon hits the board you ain't doing nothing about it anyways then two parallel exceeds and then you get a union carrier it's over at that point it's game over unless they stop you earlier so what you want to do and what I figured out is you can apply this combo to the newer dragon link stuff let me get it all put back together real quick And so the current combo for that, sorry, I had to pause the video for a moment. You want to activate Chaos Space. Send the Nibiru to the grave. That's going to net you your Collapse Serpent. Banish your Nibiru for the Collapse Serpent. You're going to send your Collapse Serpent. Your Striker. Striker effect, or uh, you want Striker effect chain one. Collapse Serpent Chain 2, so if they negate you, you know, you still can get your Quick Launch. So Quick Launch, Wave of Burster. Uh, banish your Collapse Serpent for Wave of Burster. And then what you want to make sure you always do, I pre preached this on my last video, use this ability, or use the, the effect of 
chaos space. So send chaos space. Bring this back to the deck. Draw one card, one one random card. <clears throat> then you go into Romulus. Pretty standard Dragon Link. And then effect of Wyver Burster for your Collapse Serpent. Effect of the Romulus for Dragonity Lance. Lance. Nets you Phalanx. Yes, I'm using uh, proxies. I'm sorry, I don't have the cards. Effects of Phalanx. Um, then you're going to send these two and the Lance for Halki. You know, pretty, we're still going pretty standard uh, Dragon Link. Halki is going to summon one of my other proxies because I don't have a Vylon Cube. Halki into Link Cross. Cross effect. Now, hopefully, some of you see what we're looking at before we go into it, but we'll see. So, cube and the one star. Make you a herald. That stops all your opponent's counterplays. Um, at this point, uh, when it sends, you get your living fossil from your violent cube. Now... What I can do is if I place this living fossil and bring back one of my proxies, a phalanx, the phalanx in the one star give me a martial metal marcher. Phalanx would be banished along with the Living Fossil. Martial Metal Marcher. And then the Martial Metal Marcher, I don't have any other tuners in my grave except Cube. <clears throat> so at this point, we are one, one star, any monster, any one star away from producing the same combo that you would use, um, like I showed you, to bring out the Chaos Max, Boral Savage, and uh, um, Dragoon combo, which we're going to make right here. If I normal do my one normal summon, Black Metal Dragon, one star, boom, there we go. And we're also going to get a search for Darkness Metal. So, boom, and boom. This makes that a tuner. Heralds with their effects. Search Advanced Ritual. Chaos Max. And put Boral Savage on the board with Halki under it again. and the search for darkness metal. So just in that combo alone, remember we drew the one card off of uh, um, the chaos space. So off of the one card alone, boom. Now we can go Vanish Ritual to send the blue eyes from deck, the single blue eyes that I run from the deck to the grave for Chaos Max. Now, I see two effect monsters. So, Cube and Cross to make Anaconda. And at this point, I would go on Summon Parallel Exceed. Brings out my other Parallel. Both my parallels.
or Union Carrier. Union Carrier is going to go equip on Chaos Max, so 5,000. And at that point, I can summon from the Preda Plant, send Red Eyes Fusion, which I also run in the deck. And you could cut the Red Eyes if you wanted to, but I like to run. So I run one Vanilla Blue Eyes, one Dark Magician, and one Red Eyes Black Dragon. So that gives me two pops for my Dragoon. So that's a 5,000 Chaos Max, a 3750 to negate Boral Savage, extra deck lockout, extra negate, in hand, I had four cards plus the other four cards, or other three cards, because I used the uh, black metal. I haven't even used this. Um, you know, I could I could even continue from here. You can even get into... This isn't even using, like, quick launch for Rocket Tracer or getting your Dravine, or your Ravine for Rocket Tracer. You could go your standard D-Link play if all you did was, say I left, say I put that there. I left all this off the board. Or, I'm sorry. You don't want this here. You want to do it before. So, you want these two here. cross and cube what I how I would recommend a continuation and you can even get back to this board you can continue on with your dragon link which I am gonna run also in the deck as well um, all you need to do at that point is maybe you hit a quick launch. Quick launch gets you a rocket tracer. So you don't have to use your rocket tracer's ability to pop anything. So you can send, you know, quick launch is going to grave. What you want to do here, tracer. Where did those go? Okay. LB. Vylon cube, link cross. Make protector weld. Uh, LP effect to bring out Rotor. And that's after this combo is already done. We were at the point where, you know, we made Dragoon and that was it. You know, if we went a different direction with it, we could put, say you started a different way. Say you started that whole combo a different way or uh, with, the, with the chaos space. And then you got here and you use exactly what I, I mean, I guess it shouldn't be a different combo. But if you figure out a different way to use it. You know, get to Romulus to get to where I get to. Um, you could use one of the twin dragons here. Um, you know, that would be much easier. You'd also have much more continuation on your plays. Um, but here, Brotor, or you would use a Brotor effect to get you, you know, Levineer, you know, standard combo. <clears throat> Brotor for <clears throat> Pisty. Pisty effect brings back. Oh, shit. Pretty much any any dragon. You're looking at any dragon in here. So, just say we brought back Brotor. These makes our Yuja. So now we're talking about a hand looking like this. And then we just put Sir Yuja out on top of the three other cards that we haven't used. And then we get Levineer, which is a guaranteed Union Carrier. And then you only need one more, one more you know, monster, which Sir Yuja summons to make Dragoon. So you've got the full play again with, with more, you know, it. you could just continue on and go and go and go and go and go. I mean, I don't have the extra, we don't have the extra deck space. 
um, the extra extra deck space to put more you know more combos in um, but it is I mean if you make it through the Romulus if you get through striker and Romulus and you make that herald it's unless they force your negation of the herald you're I mean this is this is cake um, I'm gonna try and be making more videos. It took me a while. I've been trying to figure this out for a long time to figure out a way to fit Chaos Max into a, a Dragon Link. Um, I had a design a long time ago with shooting Quasar, Chaos Max, and Boral Savage. Um, I put it all out in one turn, um, but then Dragoon hit, so Dragoon was a better Omni Negate than that was. Um, so I was using that. And then, of course, O-Lion got hit. Um, so I had to figure out another way. So this is what I've been trying to figure out since. Uh, I guess that's the end. Like, subscribe, uh, standard YouTube BS. Just uh, let me know what you think. Thanks.